Hello, in this video I'll show how to create map chart using mcharts library mcharts4 I would say library in angle application so need install mcharts library with npm install at mcharts slash mcharts4 and then for it's it comes separate library for map data and this is separate package at mchar slash mchars geodata so when you do npm install this library is geo data for different maps so once you did these two commands for npm install ready to start so in my html template i created the div element with id chart div where the map will go and I had a minimum styling in my CSS just for some font size, width, height, text alignment to the center. That's it. And in my app component, I have number of imports, so importing component from Angular Core. And then importing module core and maps for mcharts and separately also importing wordlow module for geodata for world map and i'm also using some animation so anim i'm also exporting importing sorry animated module and use this this theme and so component decorator and that's it like simple everything simple and then creating chart variable of type map chart and all after view init and g after view init um, to create map so i'm assigning to my private variable map instance so it is created with create method on m4 core and there is two parameters it's html element which I, is my div with char div id and the second parameter is type of the map so it is of the uh, chart my map chart so after that we have to set up map definition which I'm getting from this module word low so I'm setting geo data on the chart to this uh, imported module and next property is projection property on the chart and it's basically the I would say look of the map or shape you can get it from the documentation so if you go to mchart.com documentation and then go to map section and they have here setting projection section but they have views for different projections and the names for them 
So I selected Miller, which looks like this. So next, and by the way, Geodata doesn't have to be from this module. It can be any data from file as long as they're presented as GeoJSON in GeoJSON format. So and then we set production and now we can create polygon series and low data into it. So each section on the map can be country or state is represented by map polygon series. So we need to create at least one. So this is done. We on the chart series property we call method push and create a new map polygon series. Saving this into variable and then we can use this variable to set different uh, load data and set different configurations. So I um, want to exclude Antarctica from this polygon series. So it done with calling ex uh, with uh, setting exclude property on the series, or they also has include if you want specify what to include, and this can be its uh, ID from the data that we. Uh, loading geodata is basically from this file ID and after that we need to load data from geojson like from here and this is done with using use geodata property on polygon series we just setting it to true and now we can configure series. It is done by accessing template. So we, we on the map polygons, uh, map polygons property, we get in template property and saving into variable polygon template and now we can set different properties on this polygon template like tool tip text I'm setting to name I'm setting polygon fill opacity and then fill and then also I'm creating hover state on the state property of polygon template and then setting fill of uh, hover state to some color and on in June destroy I will dispose the chart and that's it save and just start application And we'll see in a second what we got. Okay. Yeah, we got map. And if you hover something, it will show the name of the area. Canada, United States, and so on and so forth. And if we get rid of this, we'll get also then Antarctica here. Click here. And let's show um, what I was talking about projection so if you got different projection here uh, except this one it will be just in different shape so 
switch it to back it changes shape and then um, you can go to documentation and I did just basic setup actually low and high also can look go back to mirror and you basically can get here high and I think it won't be very noticeable but it loads more data so depending on see it like sl slower because it's more precise like the borders look different and depends on the project if you need that detailed because it will be slower because more data need to load and they like you can go here on documentation and see what they have different other configuration that can be done to this map charts but hope it helped good started and thanks for watching and see you in my next video bye